Hey, did you know you can look up what fonts you're looking at in Photoshop? It's super easy too. Let's take this New York subway sign. All you have to do is go to type match fonts. That's gonna pull up this window and make this box appear on your screen. Just adjust that box to the text you're trying to match and then give it a minute to think and search for the font we're looking for. Now, if you didn't know, the New York subway uses Helvetica for all its signage. So that's what we're looking for. But if you're using this tool, you probably don't know the name of the exact font and that's okay because Photoshop is gonna give you options. We've got tons of fonts and while some suggestions it gives are pretty out there, most of them are pretty close to what we're looking for and it even has our Helvetica. Now just select the font you want, hit okay and then when you go over to your text options, it'll be selected and you can type whatever you'd like. Let's try it again with this picture I have of a great American novel. Now I think this perspective is a little bit off so I'm gonna adjust that by going to filter, camera raw filter. Now just go to geometry and you can click this button to auto balance it. Or if that doesn't give you a result you're happy with, go over here to this option where you can align it yourself by drawing along the edges of your subject. This just lets you have more control over the adjustment. After that, just confirm and repeat the same thing with match font. Now, sadly, it isn't perfect. As you can see, out of all of the options it gave, Cooper Black Italic is the closest option it has, which is weird because even if I select it and resize it and maybe even add a stroke to have it match up with the reference, it isn't exact. What is exact though is regular Cooper Black, which was also an option in my font library. It's pretty weird, but it's still a great tool to have and Adobe is always updating software, so maybe one day it'll be even smarter. Anyway, that's all I got for you today. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Even though working on design projects may be a lot of fun, it's still incredibly time consuming and even challenging. To help you save time while still creating good work, we've got design templates for Photoshop, which allow you to finish projects within minutes instead of hours. So if you wanna get started saving time now, start by checking out our links in the description below.